for us tonight. Robin Kennedy was in her early 20s, still figuring it all out, when she started baking goodies in her parents' basement, selling them wholesale to gas stations and stores. That side project continued to grow, and just a few weeks ago, Robin opened her very own retail space in Biddeford. We stopped by the new bakery in town, where the key to Robin's success is an old main staple. About six years ago, this reformed office building in Biddeford was just a pipe dream for Robin Kennedy. The retail was really always the idea. I mean, we literally had a folder called Retail Ideas. Ideas she now brings to life in her brand new shop, Robin's Confections. Here she stirs, bakes, and sells favorite treats, chocolate covered everything. Peanut butter pretzels, and they're just, they're a little coin of chocolate. And we literally take two butter pretzels, put smooth peanut butter in the middle and cover it in chocolate and it's to die for. It's the one thing that while I'm making it, I'm always popping it in my mouth. <laughs> and if she can't create it, she finds someone who can. We've got local uh, jams, syrups, maple products, cupcakes. Uh, they are salted milk chocolate vanilla caramels. Let's do a couple of those. Okay, those are my favorite. As much as we could stay local for vendors coming in, that's really important to us, and so we try to stay as close to home as possible. In fact, it's that local flavor that started Robin's business six years ago. My stepfather has a distribution business, snack foods and such, and he couldn't find enough main made goodies like peanut butter balls, Needham, stuff like that. So we found a company, and it didn't matter what I ordered. I ordered, I could order 100 boxes, I could order 50 boxes, I got 30 every week, and we couldn't grow our business. So that's where I said, Robin, how'd you like to make Needham's? <laughs> a quick basement remodel became Robin's Confections. So this was pretty much the kitchen. A small space, but Robin used it to form her craft. I actually didn't know what Needham's were when my stepfather asked me to start making them. And when he told me that it included mashed potatoes, I was completely disgusted. <laughs> Disgust is a common response from people who've never even heard of a Needham until they taste one. And people come in all the time so excited to find Needhams and when they find out that we hand mash our potatoes, we still hand cut, we hand dip every single piece, they're really thankful and really happy. I mean, some people have come to me in tears saying, my grandmother used to make these and they're so delicious and that's really been the backbone of the company from the start. Of course, Robin uses potatoes grown in Maine when she can, and despite having moved out of the basement, her family still helps out when they can. Come to watch the show. <laughs> As the weeks wear on, the smell of chocolate and coconut will overcome the fresh paint job in Robin's brand new space. All fudge samples are free, so just don't hesitate to ask. But this new kid on the block is already impressing taste buds in town. And the community has been wildly supportive. They have been so, so nice, so sweet. Every time someone comes in, they're just, we've seen your sign and we're so happy you're here. And Wonderful. Thank you so much. All right, you're very welcome. Thanks for coming in. My pleasure. All right. It's a nice big sign, too, so it's hard to miss. With a good sentiment on it. We all need some chocolate today. Exactly, exactly. I am a very harsh critic of Needham's, mm -hmm. by the way, because my mother makes them, and right. they're so good. So I had to test out her Needham's, and I actually loved them. They were so, I brought you a sample. What did you think? I thought they were first rate. Yeah. Excellent. Because she even makes yeah. flavors, blueberry, maple, which, you know, eh, do you really purist, want to mess? It's a little little unsettling. Right, you want to mess with that, but it, yeah, she, good. she did a great job. They were job. really good. She's got a specialty. <laughs>